What is up everybody, Ron Blue, back again with another video for you guys. Today we're gonna be doing an unboxing for the Gretsch 2210. I'm really excited about this one because I had a Gretsch in the past. I'm gonna have a, probably a picture around this area right here of the actual uh, 2215 that I had. Um, and it was a really, really dope guitar for the price. So we're gonna just unbox this and see what it's looking like, how it feels. Um, and first impressions of this guitar. So without further ado, let's just jump right, right in. So we're gonna open this up. But before we do that, I was looking at the shipping before I um, hit record on the camera. And I was looking, it said it came from, um, or delivered to Motor City Guitar, which is where I picked this up at. And then, uh, but it's from Fender Musical Instruments, which had me do a little research and come to find out, um, Gretsch is owned by Fender. Um, they took over in 2002 their um, marketing, their uh, products, and so on, and distribution. So I thought that was like very, very interesting to see um, Fender Musical Instruments, um, <clears throat> where it's originally from, being shipped to you know Motor City Guitar. So I was I was just very shocked. I had no idea. Um, and then Fender actually owned Charvel too. Um, which I still haven't got my hands on the Charvel as far as like ownership wise. I've played a few and I really, really like the feel of those. But anyway, we're going to just break down, see what this is about or unbox this, should I say. I'm so used to saying break down because I do guitar lessons too, which is why you guys should subscribe to this channel. This is the only channel that does unboxings and guitar lessons and covers and so on. Like I said in the intro as well, I've had um, plenty of, uh, like I said in the intro, I've had um, a Gretsch before as well. It was the 2215. And so this one is the 2210. And I think the hugest difference is the neck pickup. Yeah, this is nice. This is like a cream white. Almost like a, um, almost like a off-white fender. Um, I had a professional, no, was it wasn't a professional. I think it was a performer, a uh, Telecaster. If I can find a picture of that, I will actually have that in a corner somewhere. Um, but it had the same color. And I remember when I first did that unboxing, I caught a yellow. And, and you all, uh, guitar geeks, corrected me almost instantaneously so this is a white color it's like a creamish color but it is really nice i mean you know for the price is 349 not expensive at all i mean well i don't want to say that but compared to fender products like um the uh, professional 2 the ultras this one is really dirt cheap we're gonna just plug this up and see how it uh sounds and um yeah go from there but what i'm actually seeing now so it's so funny now that i'm actually looking at it you can see the tuning pegs are the exact same as a mexican um except for the fact that it doesn't have the fender logo in each tuning peg but the design and model is the exact same as a fender so that's very interesting just off rip that i'm take, taking a look at here <clears throat> um but yeah, I mean, I like it. Gotta tune it up really quick. Right, so, so now that we actually have it in tune, let's take a look. Or listen, should I say? <laughs> So it's a really nice sounding guitar. And honestly, it's just one of those guitars. What you see is what you get. Um, you have the volume and then you have the uh, tone and that's it. There's no extra features, you know, but it, you almost like you just get what you pay for. But it's a solid guitar. It feels really, really nice. It has a gloss neck, um, which for a long time I had an issue with when I was a beginner. But I, I've learned to really enjoy these gloss necks like I have 
um, satin necks, of course, uh, satin maple necks. But um, when you run across that one with the gloss style, it's just one of those things is like you kind of miss, you know. Um, but that's more so preference, especially if you're a beginner. Like I said, like, I think this is a really, really good beginner guitar, um, electric guitar um, for those of you all who are in the process of learning and don't want to spend that thousand dollars or thousands of dollars for an electric guitar. This is a perfect guitar for you all. I'm going to do I'm going to play this a little bit longer, actually. Um, for maybe about a week or so, and then I'll be able to do an official uh, review, and I'll have that out for you guys. So you guys will be getting my um, my opinion on this guitar. Um, I'm gonna play it just as if it was my professional too, um, or my one of my Gibsons. I'm gonna play this thing <laughs> to the, you know, and use it as a an official workhorse, so I could give you guys my honest opinion on it. So stay tuned for that. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. This is the only channel that you're going to be getting videos like this, like I said earlier in the unboxing. Um, until next time, peace.